Hello, my name is Chris Palmer, and in today's Google My Business SEO video, I'm going to give you two tactics that your competition that's using an SEO agency does not want you to know. So during this video, I'm going to give you two tips, two tactics that you can implement right now that are free that will increase your rank in Google Maps. So these two tips will be implemented, and for those that are brand new to local SEO or Google Maps, maps really at the end of the day there's three things that you need to worry about one proximity to the user two citations there's two types structured citations that's Yelp Monta MapQuest and there's unstructured citations name address phone number that are listed anywhere online so you have proximity you have citations and the very last thing to increase your rank on Google Maps is the optimization of your GMB or Google my business listing so the two tips that I'm gonna give you today these will directly impact your ranking the very first one without using any tools I'm going Going to show you how you can find your competition citations so let's pick a test example so for a test example let's go ahead and do SEO we'll head over here to maps now we are going to use maps because our main objective is ranking in the Google snack pack or the three pack now remember your local SEO and your maps rankings are two completely different things so we're concerned about ranking in Google Maps so who's the number one ranker in Google Maps it's SEO services New York so that's who we're going to use in this example so as you can go ahead and see here let's click on their particular listing in maps let's bring it up and it's going to give us some valuable pieces of information that we are going to need to find their citations so we will need their business and we're going to bring up a notepad for this example so we're going to copy down their business name we're going to bring it over here to our notepad and then we're going to go ahead and grab their phone number and we're going to copy that and bring that over to our notepad now these two things are very important for finding citations and I'm going to show you how to do that without tools for free right now so we're gonna go right back over to Google but leave this up because we're gonna use this example for our next tip tactic or secret so you can start ranking higher in Google Maps so let's head over here to the Google platform that's who we're gonna be using today so the very first thing that we're gonna to want to do get this information right here you're gonna go right to the search bar you are gonna type and there's two of them you could put all in title or all in text for this example I'm gonna show you how to do this but you could manipulate the search strings by using advanced search operators to find citations with that being said Google is only going to display at least 100 of these citations because it's duplicated content over the web but now you have a baseline of the top 100 or maybe a little bit less citations that your main competition is building so you can go out and build those as well remember if they are ranking in Google Maps and this is what they have then this is exactly what Google wants to see so let me go ahead and show you how to do that you will type all in text you will type a colon and then we are gonna go ahead and put their business information so it's SEO services New York make sure you put a space here and then you're gonna put these inside of the quotation marks so you put their brand name in the quotation marks and then you put their phone number inside the quotation marks and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and copy and we're gonna search that now as you will see there will probably be a duplicated message that pops up that they were emitting some results that's because a citation is duplicated over the web over and over but what Google's gonna show you first is the most important citations and if this is your brand your business your industry and this is the number one ranker on Google Maps these are the citations that you need to build so let me go ahead and show you that now as you can see I bet you if we scroll down bottom as you can see repeat the search with the omitted search results because again these are the things it's showing you the same thing name address phone number we're searching for the business with the phone number so as you can see here let's go right down the line and then we can start bringing up some of these businesses all right they're on BBB so that's a really good citation they're on bright local 
They're on, on their best SEO companies. That's right here. They're on Crunchbase. They're on Apollo.io. They're on Yelp. They're on bestagencies.com. Now, I'm sure that you get the picture. So let me go back up here. All you do is type all in text, colon, space. Take their business name, put it in quotes. Take their phone number, put it in quotes. Now, let's move into the next tip about optimizing your Google My Business. Now, if these are the number one rankers, let's head back over here. The name of the business is SEO Services New York. I just want to go ahead and show you something really quick. So we're going to simply search New York SEO. You have to see that SEO Services New York is the number one ranker in the map pack. So we want to see exactly what he is doing. So without going through some of the you know phone numbers, seeing how many posts he's doing, what kind of reviews is he getting, the very next thing that we need is what services is he using along with his SEO or his main service being internet marketing because it's not showing you the secondary services so in order to find the secondary services from his main category this is how you go ahead and do that so you can optimize your Google my business listing let me go ahead and show you how to do that what I want you to do to find the secondary categories is highlight their main category Press the right click button or left click button depending on the computer you have and I want you to view page source. Now make sure you're doing it over their initial primary services so it will bring up the proper page source and what we are looking for is going to be their primary service which is internet marketing service and this is going to show us what their secondary categories are because they only have 13 res 13 reviews we haven't looked at their website they're ranking in maps but they're not on the first page so what are they doing to rank number one primary categories and secondary categories for this service business is definitely an optimization that you want to do so let me go ahead and show you that we're looking at the view page source code and this will lead us to the rest of their secondary categories so we can add them to our GMB our Google my business so we can optimize to also rank at the top of Google Maps so let's just go ahead and search that now we're gonna do control F and we are looking for in ter net all right so we found internet marketing now we're gonna go ahead and just take a look here the very first one we see their primary category is internet marketing their service the next is media company next is marketing agency then they also have marketing consultant and then they have business to business service they've also added Manhattan so with this knowledge of the number one ranker for New York SEO this could work for any industry now we know Google wants to see what other services are related to this service that Google wants to see that they're already ranking at the top because we've already seen this particular listing I'm not saying I know them this is just an example we already know that they only have a few reviews there's everything that they could do to rank on Google Maps we can also do so we have covered in this video two of the three most important things for ranking higher in Google my business maps so if you have any local SEO or Google my business questions anything related to these tips tactics or tricks if you have any other Google my business maps questions GMB SEO questions anything at all please leave it in the comments below and I look forward to seeing you in the next Google my business SEO GMB maps video have a wonderful day